Hey guys, in this edition of Bleeding Edge TV from CES, we bring you a chat with OnStar, one of our favorite brands, where they give us an update on the, the OnStar FMV, they bring us an update on uh, some API access, some new OnStar apps that are become, going to be coming out soon, um, and some more, so stay tuned. All right, guys, Andrew Edwards here at CES 2012 with Vijay Iyer of OnStar. How are you doing? I'm very good. Thanks, Andrew. Very nice. All right, so OnStar, one of my favorite products out there. Um, I love it. I actually have it in my car, my Cadillac. We were just talking about that. And um, you guys have some new things to announce. Actually, the FMV, that was announced last year, right? That was announced last year. Um, we're running pretty well. We already we launched in fall last year. Um, soft launch, kicked through the holiday season, already sold 20,000 units, and we're going strong. Very nice. So and if you're unfamiliar, the FMV, as you see right here, it's, uh, it's, you get this installed and you don't have to have a GM vehicle. You can get OnStar in any vehicle. Is, is it any vehicle? or is Almost it any vehicle. 100, mil, 100 million vehicles on the road today. All right, so you can just go get that box and get it installed and then you have OnStar. So that's pretty cool. What else are you guys showing off today? So um, two more things that we have. Uh, one that we're really proud of is we're actually going to give, we announced last night that we're actually going to give uh, developers access to the OnStar API platform or our cloud platform. That's where all of our data sits, all of our six million customers are serviced from. Uh, we announced our first partner, and I think you're, you're pretty much familiar with uh, the OnStar mobile application that we launched um, a few months ago. So OnStar, the, the OnStar mobile application actually gives you access to core vehicle diagnostics features like your tire pressure, uh, tank level, fuel level. Uh, it's got remote features. So you can unlock, your dar unlock and unlock your door, remote start your vehicle can send navigation to your car, pretty cool. Um, so this is all from your tablet or smartphone, right? Your tablet on your smartphone. Um, so now what we, what we do is if we give developers access to our API, we can actually give them access to some of those features. So we have a partner that we announced uh, end of last year, Relay Rides, the first peer-to-peer -peer car sharing service in, 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 in the world. Okay. And what we did is we actually gave them access to our remote link features. So the concept of Relay Rides is pretty simple. You can enroll your car um, once it's idle, so while you're not using it, you can earn money with your car because somebody else can borrow it. Um, and in the in the current case, what really Rides does is they build some hardware in your car. You have to swipe a swipe a card, and basically that opens the car. If you have a GM vehicle that's equipped with OnStar, you don't need that hardware installed, but you can actually the borrower can use this mobile app. It's a demo version of the app which we're going to launch soon. So in this case, what you see if you're a borrower, you download the app. So I've, I'm looking to borrow a Chevy Volt. Okay. Um, I can actually, with the navigation feature, identify the location of the vehicle. This one's now in Detroit. Uh, it'll take me, I, I get walking directions to the car. I walk up to the car, I unlock it, I get in, keys in the glove compartment, I start the car, drive off, I bring it back, lock it, and that's the whole process. No extra hardware, and this is one of the first examples of how our API is used uh, by a third-party partner. That's really cool. And so that's your app platform, and anybody can sign up to do this? Uh, so if you're in, interested, developers can sign up at dev developers at OnStar.com. We're soliciting the first reactions. We actually, when we since we um, announced it last night, I've got an onslaught of emails okay. in our development team as well. We're really looking forward for all of these great ideas. We're going to give it to selected partners first, right. and then roll out the platform even bigger. Very nice, very nice. And then you had one more thing you wanted to show us, you said, right? Yeah, so um, actually, that's, I have to show you that on the show floor. Oh, okay. <laughs> Um, it's our 4G LTE car. So last year with Verizon, we showed 4G LTE broadband in the car. What would you do if it all, all of the services were deployed to the cloud and you had 4G broadband access? So this year, we, we came back, two Chevrolet Volts, one in the OnStar booth, uh, one, in, one in the Verizon booth, and you can do a lot of things in that car. We can, you can stream music to the vehicle from, from your home. You can stream entertainment content, games. There's three different, there's three different screens, two in the back, one in the front. Uh, so your kids can watch a movie in the back back while you're uh, Skyping with your um, Skyping with a, with another family member from the front. It's a research streaming vehicle. 4G LTE. All streaming 4G LTE with minimal hardware in the car, maximum capability. Um, there's uh, it's a, it's a research vehicle, so obviously you're not allowed to Skype in the car while you're driving. Right. Um, but it gives you the idea of what you could do if you had 4G LTE in a vehicle. Okay. 
And are you planning on uh, integrating that into vehicles at some point um, fairly soon? Actually, you're going to see some of it a little bit in, in future vehicles. For instance, uh, Cadillac just announced Q, the new entertainment system in the vehicle, um, connected vehicle system. And some of the development that is in Q actually came from some of the research that we've done with those vehicles. Awesome. Well, Vijay, we appreciate you uh, taking the time to show us and walk us through the new uh, OnStar announcements. And it sounds like FMV is actually doing really well yeah, also. Really well, yeah. I mean, we're really excited. Um, we're, we're now selling across all Best Buys in North America, 1,100 outlets, in total 2,000 outlets. We're growing our business. It's a great, it's, it's almost like a Swiss army knife because it has a lot of services that you would otherwise have to buy a singular, a singular product. So it has all of our core OnStar services, crash response, hands-free calling, Bluetooth, um, crisis response. We actually just had a stolen vehicle recovery of a Chrysler 300. So it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool to see a little bit of OnStar in non-GM cars. Toyotas and Fords are the 30% of what we sell is Toyotas and Fords. So a really, really exciting product. The first consumer electronics product at GM since we've sold refrigerators with Frigidaire. As OnStar, if you've been interested in it and you don't have an OnStar equipped car, FMV is your product. You can get it at any Best Buy. Um, thanks again. We appreciate it. Until thanks. next time, I'm Andrew Weber. Stay tuned for more tech news through the eyes of GearLive.com.